good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, whatever time you're watching this video. And welcome to my current favorite new accessories. Okay, that title's a bit long. Um, I'm sure I'll shorten it in, as the actual YouTube title. <laughs> but yeah, today is going to be a simple haul video of me showcasing my favorite new accessories that I've purchased. Some of them are more classy and some of them are a little more fun and playful. So I hope that you really enjoy um, what I'm going to show today. But before we get into the things that I purchased myself, a couple items in this video have actually been gifted to me by Anna Luisa. I am so flattered that they reached out to me to help showcase their jewelry brand, which is located in New York and is actually a sustainable jewelry brand. So it's very exciting and something that I would really, really like to support. And I hope that you guys really like it too. So the two pieces of jewelry <laughs> that I received from them are currently on my neck. I don't know if you've noticed me wearing them on Instagram lately or in, have I worn this in other videos? I might have, maybe not. I think I saved it for this video. Anyways, even off camera, I wear these necklaces almost daily these days. They are just so absolutely lovely. So the first one that I knew that I had to get is this beautiful freshwater pearl necklace. And the reason is because number one, I am obsessed with pearls lately. And number two, the name of this necklace is literally called the Naomi. So how perfect can that get? <laughs> I had, I definitely had to get the necklace that has the same name as me. And I have paired it with this absolutely gorgeous chain choker that has actually been designed by another YouTuber. And it sports a tiny little pendant on the front that blends in perfectly that just simply says, be you. And it is so cute. I wish that I also had it in silver, but yeah, I love this one. I definitely think I wear this one the most out of the two necklaces, but they do stack together really, really well. Ana Luisa is also currently carbon neutral and is aiming to achieve a net zero carbon footprint by the end of 2020. And the prices are really, really fair for what you get. They are made of beautiful noble metals, sustainable resources, and honestly are just absolutely beautiful. So if you're interested in purchasing anything from Ana Luisa, you can use my code ITSNOMERS10 to get 10% off your next purchase. Let's get into the rest of the accessories that I want to show you. Um, on the theme of pearls, <laughs> I recently went to Claire's. Yes, Claire's. Um, sometimes they have really amazing stuff. And I found these absolutely adorable pearl butterfly clips. So if you end up buying the Naomi necklace as well and you need some extra pearls to accessorize, um, I highly recommend these because they're so cute and lovely and they're really, really strong. And of course I couldn't stop there because I got the big clip as well because sometimes you just need to put all your hair up. It's such an easy way to like make yourself look a little more feminine. Can the construction please stop, please? <laughs> I'm filming a YouTube video, it's very important. And now for some other things that go on your head. Um, you may already know this, but I have an obsession with hats. <laughs> I have quite the hat collection. I've even made a video about my hat collection and that video didn't even showcase all my hats. I actually forgot a couple. Um, recently, I kinda accidentally bought three new hats. Um, they're all bucket hats and I love all of them. So I'm gonna show them to you now. <laughs> the first one I'm gonna show you is just really, really simple. It is this corduroy off-white bucket hat. It's gonna match everything, super cozy. I love that it's corduroy, it makes me feel like very fall-like, so I need to wait for it to get a little cooler to pull this one out, um, but I'm really looking forward to wearing it in this cold weather that's coming, hopefully soon. <laughs> this next one is one that I'm really, really excited about because I have been following this independent artist for years now and have always wanted to make a purchase and I finally did. She goes by the name Sarless Art and she is honestly one of my biggest inspirations and she created this super cute, sad tulip 
bucket hat that I wore in my last video actually but I'm showing it to you guys again. It's just so cute. It's so much fun. Maybe not the best for fall winter, but I can't wait to wear this to death next spring slash summer. I can squeeze it in a few more times this season because it's still quite warm. And last but not least, I've got this one, which is this a bucket hat or does this, is this more like a hiking hat? Do hiking hats count as bucket hats? Well, this one is amazing. First of all, it's black with like white paint splatters on it, which is really fun. And it's got one of these drawstrings to make sure that it never falls off your head. It has UV ray protection and it's waterproof and it does a magic trick. When you're done with the hat and you wanna pack it away in your purse or something, all you gotta do is flip it inside out, shove it into itself, and ta-da! It has been packed away into a little mesh bag. I love things like this. I love anything that packs away nice and tight so you can put it in your bag, put it in your backpack, put it in a giant pocket if you have a giant pocket. And then when it like, maybe it starts drizzling out or you know the sun gets really hot or you suddenly need to do some gardening or suddenly need to go on a hike, you just go, I'm ready. Are you like me and you have been collecting pins over the years but you haven't done anything with them and they're just sitting somewhere collecting dust? Well, now that I finally have a pair of wonderful overalls, these pins have a home. Ta-da! And I hope to continue adding pins to these overalls to make them even cuter but I will tell you what each of them are. This one is from my friend Jackie, AKA Underpants and Overbites. I really, really recommend her comics. She's amazing. This is a pin from Byron McCoy. Um, you may know him from Hide and Seek Clothing, although he doesn't do Hide and Seek Clothing anymore. He's just Byron McCoy, but I have been buying his stuff for years now as well as an avid YouTube watcher. Um, he's made merch for people like Tessa Violet and Rusty Clanton and back when I was in high school it seemed like all the YouTubers wore his stuff so I wore his stuff. <laughs> These are all my Japan themed pins. Um, this one is from our trip to the Sapporo Yukimatsuri, the snow festival. This one is a Tokyo 2020 pin that dangles, it's really cute. And this one is a pin from Kakegawa Jo, aka the Kakegawa Castle. Um, where I used to live, I made sure to buy this pin so I could always remember my life in Kakigawa. But yeah, these are my pins. And the fun part about these overalls is if I don't want to wear these pins anymore, I can just take off this whole section part <laughs> and have plain overalls <laughs> for the day if I'm not in a pin adorning mood. And last but not least, I bought a new purse but not just any purse. It is actually two purses that come as a set, and one looks like a piece of toast, <laughs> and the other looks like a fried egg. <laughs> I am obsessed. <laughs> so, fun fact about myself, I pretty much eat this for breakfast every single day. It is just the easiest thing to eat, and I think it's delicious. I feel like nothing can really beat like a fried egg on toast. Just amazing. <laughs> so when I saw this advertised to me on Instagram, Instagram advertisements are starting to get better and better. It's, it's really dangerous. <laughs> I knew that I had to purchase it and I knew that I would definitely find some ways to style it. So yes, this is my toast purse and this is my egg purse and you wear them together and they're really really cute and this mini egg purse is actually perfect for if you live in a city where you need a transit card because i just slip mine right in here my little pasmo for the trains and the buses so that it is always hanging off the side of me for me to just tap 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 on uh on the transit so I can pay for my ticket. So yeah, those are all my new favorite accessories. Let me know which ones are your favorite and don't forget to check out Ana Luisa. Um, big thank you to them for supporting me and my channel and everything that I do on the internet. Uh, yeah, I'm very flattered. <laughs>
I hope you are doing well. Take care of yourself, eat well, and I will see you in the next video and everywhere else on the internet. Bye!